Hey yo yo, what is up guys? Flame here. What I'm gonna be talking about today is a new I guess you could kinda call it a series, but it's more like an activity, I guess. Um and basically all it is is I'm gonna be starting to host car meets on the PS4. Um what the car meet is gonna consist of is we can do drag races, a whole car show, and even car cruising. Um, you know what I mean? Just let me know. I think it sounds pretty fun. We could either do all three, two of the three, or, you know, we could just do the show. It doesn't really matter to me, you know, as long as, you know, I just see that we're, you know, I just think it'd be fun to do. But uh, the drag racing seems pretty awesome, and so does the, you know, just the whole car show. You know, that whole thing sounds pretty awesome, too. You know, but a lot of people do car shows, but it's awesome, you know, maybe after the car show, could bring cars down and do some drag racing. Anyways, though, that's really it. That, that's the whole point of this video. I just want to let you guys, you know, see, like, you know, because that's, that's what I'm really feeling like doing, you know. Um, my PSN is V-A-L-D-E-R-R-I-C-K-3. That's my PSN on PS4. Send me a message, not a friend request, because I don't want to have a million friends on my thing. Because when I go to invite people to parties and stuff, it just crowds it. And I don't really, you know, I don't really like that. But I wouldn't mind, you know, a friend request. I mean, a message request, you know, because you can message me and then I can invite you to my party and my session and everything. That's really the way to go. Um, so, yeah, just send me a message. I'll also have my PSN down in the uh, comment section, you know, for you guys to add. Um, you know, it's just it's something, you know, and I figured it's something I could do with the subs. Um, also, this is also what I'm going to be talking about. I'm going to make a video video on it next uh this is basically i'm gonna do be doing a modded car giveaway and i'm gonna do a whole video on this so i'll just shorten it up but basically stay tuned to my next video because it's just gonna be about me giving modded cars away there's some there's gonna be some things i need basically it's just gonna be turning post notifications on and um you know that's basically it. Just make sure you turn post notifications on. Stay active in the comment section. You know, comment stuff, and uh, just all of those sorts. You know what I mean? Just do all that, and I have no problem. You know, giving some modded cars away for free. I can all invite you to. A, you know, I can invite a bunch of people to a session and give some cars out. Like I said, just do those things. Post notifications. Maybe tell some of your friends about my channel. I'm trying to get to 2K, but I'll get more in depth of everything. You know that I would like to see and then i'll give away some free modded cars which will be nice but back to the main topic if you do want to join i'm actually going to be hosting a car meet this isn't the modded car giveaway but this is i'm going to be hosting a car meet on saturday which is this saturday in two days um and it's going to be at 7 p.m eastern standard time so i don't know where that'd be for you but you can look it up uh, i'm in pennsylvania in the united states so um for me it'll be six and uh, that's eastern standard time but whatever it is for you you know you can you can join i have no problem with that uh, it'll be pretty cool everyone can show off their cars uh, you know I, it could just be a car meet i might even do a live stream on it i'm most likely yeah i'm gonna do a live stream on it if we get enough people it's not worth it if i only have six people but i'll invite some people that you know i know on psn and also you know all my subs can come in you know, you can have up to 30 people in a lobby, so it'd be really awesome if my subs would be like, oh yeah, you know, we could join, you know, and I can get everyone in here. That would be awesome. You know, at least I think it would. Just having all my subs and some of my friends, you know, because you're my friends too, my subs, you support me and my friends, and um, people on my PSN, like everything, you know, I just think that, you know, that's something cool, for me at least. It also shows that you guys are staying active with my channel, which is another thing about the modded car giveaways. I, I want people to be active, liking my videos and stuff, you know. I don't want, and I appreciate that I have 1,800 subs, but it just seems like you guys aren't active enough, you know. With the, the views I get on my videos, I just, I don't really know. And there's a few of you I know that are active, because I always see you commenting, but it's the same few people every time. It's like school, you know what I mean? Like, usually... I don't know if it's the same for you, but you know, you got that same group of people who are always down to answer questions, and then everyone else is just kind of like, eh, you know, they don't really care what's going on. I, th I feel like that's how people are with my videos sometimes, you know, they don't really care about them, they don't take time to watch them usually, but maybe people watch this and decide to join the car meet. You never know. Uh, that'd, that'd be pretty cool. 
you know, you can stand your cars, and if you don't know how to do that, you can't have bulletproof tires, and you just shoot the middle of the rim. I actually stand my hot knife here. I don't know if you can tell, but it's really low to the ground because I stand it. It's, it's pretty low, you know. It's not a low car to begin with, so that's why it might not look low in certain parts, but I definitely I stanced it. And yeah, it looks pretty nice stanced. But yeah, I mean, you could just, we could do so much, you know. I mean, that's up to you guys, you know, if you want to join or whatnot, but I just think it would be cool. Uh, you can let me know your thoughts in, you know, the comments. And like I said, I'll be posting my PSN down there. You can add me. The first car meet's going to be this Saturday, 7 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Uh, you know, I would like to really get a full lobby. I mean, if we could have a nice car meet, you know, that'd be great. Also, a couple of things I'd like to mention if you're still watching this far into the video because, you know, it's just we're probably decently far. Um, a few things I'd like to mention is no killing. Oh, whoa, someone's ran into me. Uh, no killing because when people kill, it messes the whole entire lobby up. You know, they, they start killing. And all it takes is for one person to start killing it and other people, it's like a, like a plague, you know, one person starts killing one dude, and then the whole lobby's like, oh, let's, let's just everyone kill, and, you know what I mean, I understand killing's fun in GTA, but there's a time and a place for killing, you know, and, in a car meet, it, it's just not the time, you, you go in a car meet to have fun, not to battle, or see who's better at killing, you know, you go in a car meet to, the, you know, to, just cruise, have fun, it's like a chill time in GTA, at least for me, you know, um, I definitely, it shouldn't be a, you know, it shouldn't really be a battle or anything, uh, so yeah, just no killing, if, if someone does start killing, um, then, you know, if they start killing, then they're gonna get kicked from the meats, um, but then the next thing I'm gonna start talking into sort of has to do with killing, I mean, a little bit, um, but it's a little bit different. So, respect everyone's cars. Alright, people bring their cars to the shows because they like them to look nice and they want to bring, you know, their favorite car to the show. Well, if you're coming in, you know, car blazing, uh, and you, you just say, you know, you just start hitting their car or anything, you know, I've seen that. There'll be a whole lineup of people with their nice cars and then there's that one dude that comes in and he's like, oh yeah, you know, this looks fun. So he comes in with his like gauntlet or something, you know. And usually it's a lower rank, but sometimes it's high ranks too, so I'm not like calling names here. But yeah, I mean, it's just, <laughs> they'll come in and wreck the whole show and then everyone has to repair their cars and it just sucks. So don't do that. Also respect, you know, not to kick their car. I don't want anyone kicking each other's cars and stuff. You know what I mean? Be respectful. You get, uh, you know, it's not that hard, guys. It's very simple. Just be respectful. Don't go around, you know, if someone's car is parked there, don't mess with it or anything, you know, because people bring their cars there for a reason. You know, there's not really much more I have to say about that. It's common sense. You know, they have their car. They brought it. It's cool. And they don't want you kicking it and stuff and messing it up. <laughs> no, a point blank. Don't, don't, you know, kick their cars in the meat. I wouldn't even get in the car and, you know, if you put your middle finger out the window, puts the window down. I wouldn't even do that because some people want their windows up. You know, just be respectful of other people's builds because that's another way uh, fighting starts. That's what I was getting into earlier. I was getting at that. Uh, this is where it kind of has to come into fighting because, you know, well, especially if you come in car blazing and start just, you know, wrecking to everyone's cars, people are going to get aggravated. And if you do it once... You know what I mean? You know, if you do it on purpose, then we're kicking you. Um, and I can't really see how you do it on axe. And I was going to say, you might get away with it once, but definitely not twice. And I wouldn't even do it once because I'm going to be pretty aggravated myself, you know, seeing that you just came in and you, we know you did it on purpose. But, uh, you know, it just, I'd be able to see that, you know. And they'd be able to see that. And it's just like, don't do it, you know. Because then they're going to start killing you. And then the whole lobby's gonna start killing and the car meet's over by that time you know then then people who actually want to do the car meet and not in the mood you know not trying to kill because they were trying to chill like me then they're like oh screw this lobby yep another car meet turned to shit you know excuse my french but that, that's exactly how bad it is you know that you know that's really it it's, that's the extent of it that's how bad you know they're like screw this i'm leaving 
and then you know you guys just keep killing and it turns into a straight team deathmatch lobby or a free for all it's just really it's just annoying and don't do it so we come in this to have fun you know drag race cruise do car show you know and just relax chill lobby um but yeah i do hope that you guys send me a message on psn so i know that you're interested in the car show that way i can send you invites on saturday um you know to come in because it would be cool to have a nice 30 player you know or like 23 players i'm not really saying i want a whole lot that would be cool if we got you know even a half lobby full of people just so i know that people are actually wanting to come to my car shows i just i don't want you know those three same people who comment on all my vids to you know come to the car show and be like all right we're here i'm not doing a lot of shit my three people i mean you guys are awesome because obviously you're the ones who always are active but it's not worth live streaming for three people. I need my subs to come together and, you know, get a nice lit car show that's peaceful. I know it's a lot of people, but, you know, you can kill a GT anytime. That's what free mode's for. When we're in an invite only session, when we're showing off our cars and doing what we need to, killing me is not one of those things or killing other people. It's definitely not what we came to do. So you can go back in free mode if you feel like you have to kill. Which I don't really see. Honestly, killing in GTA is overrated. Obviously, at times it could be kind of fun, but um, that's not what the whole game's about. You know, they they add these cars for racing and stuff too. The game's more. It's a it's a sandbox game, which means it's universal. Yeah, a sandbox game is just a game that has unlimited almost opportunities. I guess you could say, where you know it's you're not just limited like Call of Duty to one thing. You know, to killing. It's like you can kill, you can, you know, if you want to drive cars, you can, boats, you know, you can, you do anything, you know, there's just, there's a lot. So yeah, that's really all I wanted to, to, you know, get into for this video, just tell you about this, you know, some background info and everything else. Uh, but yeah, I will be hosting that, I hope you guys enjoy, and yeah, with all that out the way, that's, uh, you know, that's it, just... Uh, you know, send me a message. My PSN will be in the comments. And this be your boy, Young Flame. I'm signing out. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. And peace.